watching Juke again. I just went to a big camera to go to get my hair curl from Hair Girl. Here it is. I finally got it. I'm so happy. I'm so excited. And now I'm at Gongcha. I love Gongcha and the drinks. The Terra drink is my favorite. And then after Gongcha, I'm meeting up with a couch serving host to take pictures together. I was super hungry, so I got my favorite taro milk tea with grass jelly. Hi! Hi. This is Yusuke. san um, <laughs> Anyway, so this is the guy I told you before about. He is the photographer. Yeah, I have to Going to take out. pictures. Yeah. Anyways, now it's the first time that I'm actually in Harajuku and in front of us is Takeshi Tadori, which is. Uh, can you. I'm so excited to walk down the street because I've never been here before even though this is my second time in Japan and I've been to Shibuya Shinjuku and Omotsan shopping but not here so let's go shopping any of the cherry earrings because first they were for unpierced ears and second I couldn't decide on the color. The sock shops were amazing and I really really wanted to buy lots of cute socks but I was just overwhelmed I didn't buy anything. Amarel was on my list of the shops I wanted to check out. When we accidentally found it in the Harajuku older building, I went totally crazy. Even though everything was very cute, I actually couldn't find anything I really liked until I found this absolutely amazingly gorgeous yellow princess-like coat. This is so pretty. Uh, I can't. Uh, I think I'm actually gonna buy this. It's so gorgeous. It's just even the yellow. It actually looks really, really nice on me. Oh, I love it so much. It even has pockets. And look at the sleeves. It's so beautiful. And just everything is so pretty. Uh, I'm gonna buy this now. Next we went to the Disney store and I think it was super successful because I finally found something I liked because I bought three hair accessories. This is the first Disney headboard I bought. I wanted this one for more casual outfits. He says this is mini, but yeah. I, I can't, I can't see. This is the ribbon, and this is the ear, it's me. and this is the. <laughs> <laughs> it's me. For the rest of it, I couldn't decide on anything because I just didn't know how to cram everything into my suitcase. And second, do I really need this? They are so pretty. This is like Cinderella, Rapunzel, and the other one is mini. These are all like my favorite colors. I'm so lucky. <laughs> Inside the Harajuku Alta building is also Alice Lisa shop, so of course I had to go in. I was lucky because they also had a sale on, ranging from 20 to 50 percent off. I was looking for these shoes, so I was super happy when I found out they were 50% off. So I tried on the shoes and I totally fell in love with them. Of course I didn't care whether they were comfortable or actually quite painful, but I found that out later. And since they were 50% off, I bought them without a second thought.
We want to find out where Sakusaku is because I really want to try this long custard filled thing. And of course, I'm not wasting my time missing out on some Pokemon. We finally are in Sakusaku and it smells so good in the shop. I'm so excited to get the custard filled thing. It's crispy and I just love vanilla custard, so I'm so excited. We got two flavors, both are just vanilla custard, but the other one has white chocolate on top. But I'm just having the plain one and Yusuke has the one with the white chocolate. I'm <laughs> just so happy today. Mm, it's so good. Holding pasta. <laughs> What did you say? Holding you up, you have I get vodka. Oh, you know. So, go ahead, what is your name? So delicious. I'm so happy. <laughs> I had never heard of the Lolita brand 2 Alice until I stumbled upon it on Takshita Dori. Their clothes were quite sweet and I think pretty good quality. The newly opened Style Nanda store was super pretty but oh so expensive. I had to restrain myself from buying anything but I knew that I would be going to South Korea at the end of my trip and everything would be much cheaper there. I really wanted this rose gold glittery pigment for under the eyes but it was about 20 euros so I passed on it. Right opposite Stalnanda there's the cute cube Harajuku building and there's also a sundry store inside. <laughs> We found the Line Friends store, but it was not reopened yet because it was under construction. On our way to Shibuya, we checked out the Sakura Merch in Starbucks, but I couldn't find what I was looking for. After a long time walking down Takashita Street and taking lots of pictures, I was super surprised when we saw that gang of Mario Kart drivers. It was really, really difficult, believe me. It was so difficult to come here because Google Maps. After much painful walking around Shibuya, we finally made it to this Kuchiaka restaurant. So we are finally inside the shop and it's really, really packed with really, really nice atmosphere. And I'm just getting vegetable Kuchiaka because vegetarian. And we have some cabbage and sauce. <laughs> There were a lot of interesting ingredients like pickled red ginger, a strange and bitter flour, taro root, lotus root, quail eggs and ginkgo nuts. Yes. Beans! It's really good. Oh, guess what? Yeah. Ginkgo nuts! This is so exciting! I always wanted to try ginkgo nuts! Oh my god! Another surprise item! <laughs> I think these are small pepper. Was she? There's a very special vegetable. We don't know what it is. I will tell you. Oh my god! It looks scary. It, oh my god, it looks so scary. I have no idea what that is. It looks like a flower. Red ginger. Skoi. Okay, let's try it. <laughs> it's like the pickled red ginger. It's actually delicious. Today was such a such such a great day. Um, I just like met our husband Daniel. actually, we 
the uh, couch surfing, this really, really nice Japanese guy. He is a freelance photographer. We did a lot of photo shoots that I did not film. He let me shop in Harajuku Takishibutori and he helped me carry my stuff. It's just such an amazing, amazing experience. I'm so super happy. Again, I totally forgot to end the vlog, but future me will end this vlog properly for you. Please subscribe to my channel if you like this type of video because I'm uploading many many more Japan vlogs and don't forget to comment below because I'd really like to hear your thoughts on my videos. Bye bye and see you in my next vlog. Bye bye!